so today is the big day oh my gosh i'm so excited i am a little scared honestly but i'm i'm excited our wagon finally came in after what two and a half months after forever after forever and i was literally going outside getting something out the car and fedex was driving up it's been crazy but it's here it's been like several delays everything like that so the guy just dropped it off and it is here now i'm not sure if we by the time you see this one if we spoke about i know we spoke about getting the wagon but i don't think we actually showed you or everything like that so I guess we'll do that now. Go ahead and do a little unboxing. It got a little weight on it. They say 55 pounds. <laughs> y'all don't know. Cause, well, I guess technically y'all won't know by the time you've seen this. But we sold our Vista, which was very sad. But the babies outgrew it. So we decided to get this wagon, which we didn't know was going to be terribly popular at the time. And it was a new product on the market because apparently Wonderful hasn't sold a new product in over 10 years. What? Yeah, so we just happened to choose the best time to be get a popular product. So um, I'm hoping for the best. There has been on and off quality issues because of the master man. Then... On top of that, they keep selling more stuff. They just came out with another version cheaper. Scandalous. Now, it's a chance that we might have still got this version, but still give me the option. Mm -hmm. Now, the crazy thing too is other websites was getting theirs faster. And if I didn't get such a good deal, and we got it at the time that it was cheaper, mm -hmm. it, was a, it went up $100 more. So mm -hmm. we got this one plus a, a snack tray less than is my snack tray here? It's over there. Huh? It's over there. Oh, you're not talking about that. That's the other thing. No, this seemed like a original pack. I don't know. We gotta see. Okay, we better be in here, y'all. I doubt it, but... I doubt it, too. That's when I'm like, where's my snack tray? We just gonna confirm that it's not in here. So we're gonna go ahead and do a little unboxing. Try to put this together. And then go from there. So the one that we got was W4S 2.0. It just came out with a W4. 2.0, it's like a Samsung phone, different variations, different prices. So this one is a quad, which means it has four seats. You guys, so yes, you do see the snap tray. The snap tray is actually in here. I'm surprised that they actually put it in the box because everyone else is a habit, but I don't know, maybe do something different. So with the snack tray, it does come out and it has like a slippery side and a cloth side. It's supposed to be for activities. This is supposed to be for eating. I have seen people put like the parchment paper or however you say that in this and then put food on it so that it's just easier to clean. And then um, there's actually cup holders on the side. I don't know how great they are, but yeah. Look how big this wheel is. I know y'all probably see people talk about this, but the wheel's actually pretty big. And they're hard. Yeah, they're hard wheels. I wonder, is rubber wheels better than hard wheels? I don't know. No idea. But then I figure if it's hard rubber, then you have to keep filling them. Nobody got time for it. It looks like, for the most part, we got it together. Probably be a good idea to put seats in it, right? Nah, let's throw them in there. <sighs> oh yeah, I forgot it had that thing. Okay, sleep. Mm. So that is a shade, just in case the baby's asleep, that the sun won't hit them in the face. As you can see, this is mesh. It has this little opening, just in case you want, like, the babies to crawl in. 
zipper on the outside. I don't know what a zipper on the outside. Oh, they can crawl in? Yeah. Wow. If you want them to crawl in, all the zippers on the outside. They can crawl in or if you want to put stuff at the bottom. Also, as you already seen, David had put this little thing here. It's pretty, I, it's it, pretty good in size, for, yeah. I would say. Yeah, it's pretty good in size. It's not like insulator or anything like that. But I reckon for me, it's, we'll probably always keep like a change of clothes, diapers, wipes, just steadily in here. Snacks and things like that. And then we don't have to worry about a diaper bag. Yeah, we won't do the diaper bag. We'll just keep it in here. It's this, got some pockets on the outside too. Yeah, it got pockets. It has this cup holder right here, as well as um, a little slip here. And that's pretty it. But this thing is pretty sturdy. Let me check the wobbliness. Because I remember people talking about that in the chat, the lobby is. Mm -hmm. I mean, honestly, ours don't seem crazy wobbly. <laughs> I guess we're going to be doing that a lot, breaking things with this huge thing. I know. <laughs> so it don't seem crazy wobbly. I mean, it's understandable. It also has uh, pockets in the side here with the wonderful logo. So it has that as well as some a pocket in the front. I mean, this would probably honestly be a better place to keep some light. Yeah. Diapers and stuff like that. And you got the same stuff on the other side. Yeah, here as well. Okay. One thing I think is would be pretty cool when we're out, say in an open out park or anything like that. One thing would be good about this with the sunshade, I reckon, is that you drop this down and then you can just change the babies in the bottom of here. And mm -hmm. not worry about people seeing, don't have to worry about going to the bathroom. You just move one seat off, lay something at the bottom, change them inside of here when nobody can see them because that thing is black and you can't see through. Mm -hmm. So I think that could be a good little alternative. So let's go ahead and put on the seat. What's in these other boxes here? Like that. Oh, yeah, that, that was the wheel. Yeah, so this is the snap tray. This is what it's supposed to seem like. I did end up buying the tray hack yesterday, so I'm just going to be comparing the two. If I like this more, uh, I would keep this, or if I like the snack tray hack more, then I would buy the second one and sell this one off. It fits pretty sturdy. A lot of people say it's flimsy though, so I'm not really sure. Obviously, we never had one. We never even had a wagon, a stroller wagon before. A lot of people who go into the stroller wagon, they have had experience with stroller wagons. We have absolutely zero experience. <laughs> so do not take us as a, a median or... We're first timers. Yeah, we're very much first timers. So that's what that one looks like. And like I said, I had got the snack tray from Big Lot. Apparently this is... This in Target, I think, is the only place you can get these. But a lot of people seem to like this better. So let's see how this is. Hmm. I thought that was for us. No. <laughs> yeah, no. No, this is a lot of people are getting these instead because they said it was more sturdy and it is. It is. It is. This one has cup holders though. This one has cup holders. Um, I am gonna be buying more accessories and stuff like that. I already got an extra canopy. So that is actually on the way now. And also, we did get this in the very beginning, and this came pretty fast because we got it from somewhere else. And that one's insulated. Yeah, this is the parent console for um, from Wonderful. Well, honestly, no matter where you buy any Wonderful product, it's going to come from Wonderful. It just bought through a different seller. Don't let them fool you. And it comes faster. It comes faster. So this is the parent console and it has like this magnetic flip over thing. Ooh. Ooh. It seems that a lot of people don't care for this. I don't know why. I guess we will find out. One thing I thought was cool about this is that there is wire open right here. So it has like a little wiring if you feel it on the side like this. Mm -hmm. So it's not like going to be caving in. Mm -hmm. I think people may not like it because it has the Velcro. Maybe they're like, there's concern with the wear and tear on the handlebars. Um, I like These are replaceable, right? Yeah. Look at it already. Mm. So you see right here, there's welting. It came like this. 
and hold on put your finger there so let me use your finger as a marker yep so yeah, my nails dirty <laughs> no babe it's not that deep <laughs> so you see this ruching and caving in like that mm -hmm. regularly if we had did a red wear and tear on this and we've seen that this would not bother me at all mm -hmm. but i think i might say something only because we have never used it so once we start using it it's gonna mess up yeah as you see on this side it's not like that probably gonna put in a claim and also when it get any wonderful you got a year automatic warranty on everything yeah i don't have any cup or example to see how big the thing will be maybe that um sippy cup right? let's see this is a sippy cup by the way, I got this from the Dollar Tree. I think these are good. Yeah. I actually like these. Yeah. So, might need to stock up on these. I kind of think that I like the setup of both seats pointing outward. This one. Yeah. So, this is what it looks like if you use it like this. I mean, granted, I could pull this one a little bit back and then you have a little bit more foot room for the front. I kind of like this idea because they can see the same thing. And then also with this one, you can put one strap. It don't have to have two straps. And put it in these two holes. So a lot of people say they don't like this because kids can figure out how to get themselves out. If they just learn to do this. Yeah, they learn to do this. I think it'll be a while before our kids really bother with this. Cause our kids are never really concerned with their waist straps. Look, they got pockets in the sides. Oh, yeah, that's pretty nice. Man. Put the tablets right there. Mm-hmm. And they're done. So I'm gonna get a little tablet thing right here in the front, but I think it'll be nicer if they have their own direction versus facing each other. But we gotta pick up the kids. So we're gonna rush back and then we're gonna forget, um, continue to talk to you about everything. All right, y'all, some things happen and it's a new day. So I believe the last place we left off talking about was the little parent council thing. It's, it's testing out day. So I ended up packing the stroller today because we are getting ready to go to Ikea. We wanna kinda test it out among other things. So we are about to hit the door. So uh, everything in here and hopefully we're doing good. So I just like over pat waters because I use powder uh, cool it in the water. If you hear the screaming, obviously. We used uh, powder Kool Aid for the water as well as milk and stuff like that. They are still totally fine with powdered milk. So, yeah, I kind of just packed everything and now they're just like touching everything for no apparent reason. I put the canopy up here. I don't believe that I showed you guys what that looks like, but pretty much with this, I put the little straps through the hole. I don't see the real big reason to have to snap this perfectly uh, because it is in front of the council and the council kind of have it, but I use this one over here just to kind of help it go. So I packed them a couple of waters. Ain't really nothing else in here, waters. And then there's these little things right here, which is waters. These come in a two pack from the Dollar Tree. So I just got a whole bunch of this because I do um, use powder Kool-Aid and water mixture for their juice for when they're sleepy and fussy, they like milk. So that's why when I open this, you'll see Noel's milk because they both will drink it. I do got a Lunchable here. This was kind of frozen. So, um, I have it sitting in here. I still use this thing right here. I used to use it for their powder formula. So this is mainly just their juices and I have it pre scooped out. What else is in here? I have two things of snacks, which is popcorn. They like popcorn. So I have that as their on the go snack. A change of clothes here. And that's pretty much in here, all that's in here. And this is what that looks like. It's not in there pretty because I am just a catch-all type person. I throw it in there and keep it going. And that's pretty much what my diaper bag looked like. I don't know if I want to bring both snack trays or one. I'm probably just going to bring both and just stuff it underneath the seat. Then we got the other one. 
under the seat so that's what that looks like they did get in it yesterday so that's why it might look a little slightly dirty i kind of sampled it out once they got home because they kept messing with it and that's what the other one looks like yesterday also i did end up changing one side to the middle seat and I only did one side because I wanted to kind of walk through how to do it before I actually show you guys how to do it. And it is an annoying process, I can tell you that. I did put all the diaper bag situation, like the pull-ups and diapers. I ran out of diapers, so I only got pull-ups, wipes, and this is the changing pad. I couldn't find my doggy pad, so I just have to bring the changing pad for now. And that's really it. So I'm about to bring this outside and show you guys what that looks like loading it into the car. If you don't know, I do have a Chrysler Voyager, which is the same as that car as Pacifica, but just with a cheaper price tag, honestly. After several hours, we're actually <laughs> at IKEA. We finally got the babies in the car, in yeah. in the wagon, but it's a learning curve. For us. <laughs> we're learning, mm -hmm. so let's try to go in. Right now, I'm deciding to use the tray as a backing for her. That seems to work, so we'll see how that goes. So what do you think about it so far, pushing it? Just a little bit of muscle in oh, the forearm God. area, but oh. it's not bad. It's like a um, regular shopping cart. That's what I feel like, I'm pushing I, a shopping cart. I think it, it takes time to like, how to maneuver it. Mm -hmm. I've never seen this Ikea table, ch children's table before. Oh, the brown one? Yeah. This must be new. Nice little table. Slightly taller than this one, this popular one. So I think it definitely does bring uncomfortable attention a little bit. I think you just gotta get used to it because it's always gonna happen, I think. Yeah, it's just like everyone's like, oh my God, that looks nice. Oh. I think the only place you'll see others with it, it's like a theme park or something like that that allows wagons. Yeah. Like, I think it would be less cumbersome in that because you kind of expect it. Mm -hmm. But when you go into the store, it's like, oh, oh, <laughs> we're bringing a wagon in the store. Yeah. And they look like they're in the mini school bus. Look at them. They're out in quiet though. They like it. Mm hmm. I'm chilling. Hey, baby. Hey. So, yeah, we just got to get used to it. But yeah, I think that's the only thing that I kind of felt like this when I was in the store by myself. Like, uh, 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 like I'm doing something that's unorthodox. But really, you're just pushing the stroller, but it's just... And nobody's saying anything bad. No. They're all saying like, ooh, that's cool. Ooh. That's the one I was looking for and stuff like that. But they're not saying it to us, they're saying it to themselves. So. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, all right, let's keep going. Ooh, I didn't realize there were seats right here. I do like the idea of having like a lip like that. I don't know why. I just like the look of a sink protruding like that. But I don't want a one tank sink like this. Ooh, it's a stop. Yeah. What? Do it again. 
Like, what's that do? So I can stop. Like, is it stopping put, the water? Yeah, you can push it down, stop the water, or pull it up, or let the water drain. It's a drain underneath it too. Yeah. Is that a magnet? Hmm? I was about to say, is that a magnet? I like the the box only because it's different. It's different. Yeah. I get it. I can get it. Yeah, it's so weak in my knees. Also, too, I think I need to get used to confidently vlogging in front of people. I'm not. I'm not there. I forgot we had the camera. <laughs> I'm just stuck somewhere. <laughs> Where's your juice go? I don't know. Let's see. If I, I got a little pocket here, so I put it in. We ain't got a purpose. <laughs> so far, so uneventful. This is the hardest couch I have ever sat on. Terrible. You want a snack? Huh? Huh, no, Ellie, Ellie. Give me kisses. Give me kisses. Mm. Get your butt up before they come and tell us we broke something. So, I think I told you this already, but I was using this to hold Noel up. But now, Nala is using it to watch her stuff. She seemed pretty fine with it. Noel is sleepy. Look at this. She's a sleepy girl. <laughs> she like, what are we doing? Uh, yeah, I don't really have much to say. It's too early. It's way too early to make any commentary. The drive is different because it's bigger, but it's different because it is different. <laughs> we'll just see. To, to be continue, child. All right, y'all. So, come on, babies. Noah and and her little teddies. Come here. Come here. <laughs> come here. So we're finally back to the house. Sorry for the abrupt stop. Uh oh. I'm getting all oily and everything like that. But it was starting to get tiring. The eyeballs in the commentaries. The commentators, that's what we call it. <laughs> the commentators. Between that, the girls, they actually was pretty good, honestly. I do love that they're chilling it. And I think they really like it too. Yeah, they love it. Yeah. Yeah. We just gotta learn to use it. <laughs> we gotta learn it's mainly with the seat belts. We gotta figure the seat belt thing out. Yeah. But once we get that down pat, I think it'll be fine. But I do think that I prefer a snap over this magnetic situation. I think the magnetic thing just off the beginning is unnecessary work. I gotta figure it, the whole thing out, period. Cause yeah. <laughs> I didn't know where to start with it. I did, cause I don't like that the, okay, so I probably have to show you once we get out the car, which is not gonna be tonight, probably in another video. But when we snap on the um, sides, I thought that the side piece that snaps over the other piece was gonna be magnetic, but it's not. Mm -hmm. So you have to hold the two pieces together, and the only part that is magnetic is the crotch piece, and that's the piece holding all of it together. So I do think it's really unnecessary that I have to hold two things together and then snap the front together. Like that's unnecessary, I feel. But if you had a clip in, you can just hold one side in, then hold the other side in, it clips in, and then you just put the middle. That's it, it looks like it's interchangeable though. Overall, this was just like the introductory to the wonderful for us. I just wanted to show you guys what it was like using it as well as unboxing and that whole thing and putting the girls in and what that looked like this is very much an overview if there's something that you want to see from us talk about 
um, anything in regards to the wonderful, about the girls and the wonderful, anything like that, just comment down below. This is the W4S 2.0 because they just came out with a W4 one <laughs> that is cheaper. So yeah, this is the one that comes with the canopy. I do have a couple more accessories coming in uh in a couple of days as well as the canopy and all that stuff that it stands because y'all guys did not see the canopy in this video so i will show that in future videos so yeah just comment all that stuff down below please give this video a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and we'll see you guys in the next video say bye bye bye, bye.